use Google to search for seller then you look at seller you click on it and then you do your registration username whatever name you want to be identified by enter your email address and then go on to enter your surname and then you create your password with which you use to access your seller account anytime your password should be known to you alone all right so when you're done creating your password you don't create your account okay you can see here that the username has already been used so we provide another one so i'm going to provide another username here i'm going to use amaka king okay so when you are done with that you go back again to update your account create the account okay it's saying here that you need two names okay where it's supposed to be full name that means surname and first name so i'm done with that the account has been created so the next thing will be to set up your bank details i'm using a gtb account so i'm going to put up gtb that's guarantee trust and then my account number and then click on verifying account you can see that my name has come up all right so i'll continue from there so am i sure the account belongs to me sure so the account guarant is saved all right so i am here to create a digital product but if you want to create a physical product or a ticket or subscription up to you so digital product all right so when this page opens i start uploading my details so here i am uploading a flyer of the product so it can either be a flyer of the product or the book cover because we are talking of an ebook here all right so the name of my product is my business clarity workbook okay so the price i'm going to use a slash price so i'll put up one five here 1500 naira i'm doing that because i want to strike off the original price so i've just clicked on show strike out original pr price so the original price is three thousand you will see how it will end up showing on the finished page okay this is where you put any description you want of your product but before i go to that i'll fill up the category and then the category is actually a business book so that's the category of my book and then the subcategory is content creation all right so let me then fill up the description of the book do you need clarity in your business such that you understand what next step to take at every particular time all right so make sure that the description of your book is a is a synopsis of the content of your book so that not necessarily synopsis but something that captures the content of your book the aim of your book so that it will help your customers buying decision all right so this other part now is i would like to give buy access to a file so i want the file to be downloadable so i'll simply click on that that downloadable then the next thing is for me to give access to the file so once i click on the downloadable file it will now ask me to upload the file so i'll just get the file from my google drive and that is it my business clarity work okay bad network all right so i'm going to change the option now to read only so i'm deleting my file the file i've uploaded so i'm going to change it to read only pdf so it's so you can see that i've unchecked the give buyer access to file and i've put automatically direct the buyer to a url so i'm going to copy the url for the book for the ebook and then 
that is what I will put up there in this um, box for the description for the link of the book so whenever my customers open this page they have it so I create my product now you can see that congratulations your product has been added and that is the link for my product so it is this link now that I'm going to copy and put somewhere that I'll be giving my customers so that they can access the book they do their payment they access the book and it is theirs all right so you see i'm copying the link now which i'm going to copy to paste somewhere you can see what i've done you can see how it shows so my customers i just give them that link once they click on it this is how the page opens and those are the details they just click on buy now once they